What exactly have you been doing? How do you meditate? You sit down, you relax, and then you repeat a sound to yourself. And it sounds daft, but it's just a system of relaxation. And that's all it is, you know, there's nothing more to it. So that we meditated for about five hours a day in all, you know, sort of two hours in the morning and maybe three hours in the evening. And then the rest of the time we slept, ate, sunbathed, and had fun, you know. Uh, Ringo Starr came back a bit early and he described this place as a holiday camp. Would you agree? Yes. <laughs> well, it is a bit like that, you know. I mean, but that, that's, a, that's, a, that's a good description. That's not disparaging. How much did it cost you? I don't know. It's very cheap, you know. I mean, it's not like uh, your Hilton hotels. But the Maharishi has been criticised rather a lot for taking a very commercial outlook. Yes. But that's got to happen. You know, he's, I mean, people must... Cri anybody who takes money, you know, people are going to criticise. But every religion or every institution takes money. It's got to have money to keep it going, you know. I mean, he, he himself has got nothing. He's got a robe, a pair of sandals, you know, and a chair. You know, and, that, it's, and he eats nuts and stuff, you know. I mean, you know, he hasn't got a lot of money himself. He doesn't use it on anything. He hasn't got flashy cars or anything. Uh, all the money goes to set up academies, you know, and that's the whole point of the money. So that, you know, there are a lot of churches in, in the world, far richer, and who take more money. One Indian MP accused this uh, place of being an espionage centre. <laughs> yeah, uh, you, in fact, that. of being a, a, spies, a spy for yeah. the West. What, well, uh, don't what tell happened? anyone. It's true. <laughs> it is. We're it? spies, yeah. yes. The four of us have been spies. Actually, I'm a reporter, <laughs> and I joined the Beatles for that very reason. But uh, story's out next week in the <laughs> paper, which will be nameless. Jane, did you go for a holiday, or did you go to meditate as well? Oh, to meditate, yes. And uh, what effect has it had on you? This presumably is your first big meditation. Mm. It, it uh, I think it calms you down. It's hard to tell because it was so different, life out there. It'll be easy to tell now that I'm back and we're doing sort of ordinary things to see just what it does. Isn't this purely an escape from the hurry and scurry of the Western world? No, no, it's to train you to to be calm in the hurry and scurry. That's the point of it, not to escape it. It's just the opposite. Thank mm. you both very much.